Now I want to throw the conversation over to Gary. So uh, you are going to help us eliminate misunderstandings here? Yes. Something, yeah, something me and Susan have many all the time. <laughs> My Aussie slang trips, a lot of people love it. <laughs> well, yes, general semantics is about language, thought, and also about human behavior and human uh, growth. And one of the things is if I put the number one, O-N-E, on a piece of paper and ask the audience what it is, most of them are going to say it's one. If I put the number one on a piece of paper and ask them what it is, they're going to say it's one. Neither one of those are one. One is an alphanumeric representation of one. One's a numeric representation of one. This is one table. It's concrete. Right. People give meanings to words. Words don't give meaning to people. So it's on us as a person, whether you're listening or talking or communicating, to get your point across. And if you don't know, ask. That's ask what the other person is saying. Mm -hmm. yeah. Once recently I was in Ketchikan, Alaska, and I was in Totem Village. And one of the people asked a guy, guide there, about how many grown men are born here. And the person looked at him and goes, well, the most we can do are babies. <laughs> <laughs> right. right. So that's a great illustration of just mis misunderstandings in general. But mm -hmm. how can uh, entrepreneurs apply it? So a lot of the people in our audience are sort of that sub-500,000 or maybe even sub-$5,000. How can that help them with their well, ideas and getting it off of, the ground? A lot of entrepreneurs can look at C, uh, go to uh, UCSD, the Sanford I. Berman Chair, and you can find some books there that will help you that are available online and also like podcasts that are available by a person by the name of Sanford Berman. Okay. And they will help you as far as uh, develop your skills and that way you'll be able to market yourself better mm. to the community and to be a winner, potential winner of $5,000. <laughs> well, when you've got yeah, a 60 yeah. second pitch, you know, you have 60 seconds to convey your meaning of, okay. of what your app is. So, so I want you to give uh, the URL where people can check this out, but also you handed me this before the show. You told mm -hmm. me to read through it, which I haven't had a chance to yet, but tell me what's in my hand and, and what, do you have, what do you have back there for everybody? Well, back there I have flyers on the UCSD website that Sanford Berman uh, endowed, and he's a resident of Henderson. He has a PhD in semantics. And he's also uh, known as the world's foremost hypnotist. His stage nice. name huh. was Dr. Michael Dean. And he's the hypnotist that most of your uh, stage hypnotists or comedy hypnotists have copied at one point in their lives. Yeah, I might even go down that route. Who knows? Yeah, I can see that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Sorry, I didn't mean to <laughs> But, yeah, but uh, I have flyers back there on his website and stuff, and you can get the books for free. And that's okay. actually what that is. It's a book that Sanford Berman put out back in the 80s on uh, misunderstandings and communication and how you can develop your thought processes further. When I was an undergrad student, I was able to use his communication theories and stuff and pass 45 semester hours of college level uh, courses just by taking CLEP exams. Oh. Jeez. Dropped out. You know? <laughs> <laughs> Should have read this first. Okay, so um, so we have so we so I know we have GaryHosea.com, but you give us another URL. Mm -hmm. What where well, should people check this out? GaryHosea.com, or you can go to UCSD uh, and look up uh, Sanford Berman uh, Chair in Communications and Semantics. Okay, great. Cool. Yeah, I mean everybody can use. Less misunderstanding. Oh, so, definitely. Yeah, <laughs> increase communication. So, uh, let's give a big round of applause for our guests. Thank, Thank you. Guys. you.